Imagine how different the world would be if people could buy your accomplishments. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the 2008 U.S. Open, Larry Wilcox. You earned it. They get credit for it. And the winner of the 1921 Nobel Prize in Physics, Dr. Stephen Johansson. Would it be fair? Would anyone really believe them? Uh -oh. Take it! Open three! Hit it! David Deacon sends the Utah Jazz to the NBA Finals! Well, in the real world, you can't just buy other people's accomplishments. Or can you? Hi, I'm Kayvon Moti, Program Director for 97.5 The Blaze, KZZQ in Salt Lake City. We used to be on 94.9 with the call letters KHTB. I'm here today to remind you that the latest batch of Arbitron ratings are coming out on October 20th. Now, the new station occupying our old frequency with our old call letters are already touting how great those ratings are. The problem is, the ratings they're bragging about are not their ratings. Any claim to the contrary is quite simply a lie. See, this rating period reflects three months of listening, July, August, and September. For the past four years, up until August 11th, everything the audience heard on 94.9 was The Blaze, which is now on 97.5 with the call letters KZZQ. It was our promotions, it was our imaging, it was our presentation, it was our product. And it was that product that the audience identified with, responded to, and ultimately wrote down in an Arbitron diary. So look, I know all of this is a bit confusing, and I'm not here to tell you how to spend your marketing dollars. I'm sure you've got enough people doing that already. I just thought you should know that the numbers being presented by 94.9 don't really represent anything they've done. Simply put, we've produced results for our clients that no one else could. We're proud of our accomplishments. We hope to continue to earn your business through hard work and integrity. I'm Kayvon Moti. On behalf of everyone at 97.5 The Blaze. Thank you. 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 Thanks. Thank you.